my name is Ada. I'm Shafika. And I'm Husna. And I am Hazifa. So, what is Amriz? Amriz is a situation in which two or more countries are increasing the number and strength of their weapons. Wow, that sounds interesting. Let's check it out. The objective of this project are to learn the application of ordinary differential equations in Amriz. Second, to solve initial value problem of linear system of ordinary differential equation using Laplace transform and computer algebra system. Third, to identify types of arms race between two countries. The basic system of Richardson arms race model is The two variables x and y, each one representing a single country at time t. Each differential equation represents the rate of change of arms built up for a specific country. Here, x represents the amount of weaponry that country 1 has at time t. y is the same for the second country. The constants a and b are known alternatively as fear or reaction constants. They represent the desire of a country to increase arms at a rate proportional to the number of arms that their opponent possesses. The constants M and N are known as either the restraint or fatigue factors. They represent the desire of a nation to reduce arm stockpiles at a rate directly proportional to what they possess. Finally, R and S are the grievance constants and represent the leftovers. These constants can contain ambition, external pressure, a revenge motive, and other factors not directly related to arm stockpiles. Now, we move on to brief explanation of model. This system of equations has the various important answers only in the first quadrant. These are the different kinds of graphs that you can see on the video that we will explain to you guys later. The first thing that you guys should know is weapon stockpiles can only be positive. The second one, the only thing that can be negative or zero are constants R and S, which means negative A and B will imply negative here, while negative M and N will imply a country wishes to keep increasing the buildup of its weaponry. In this case, there are three possible outcomes for the system of differential, which are all trajectories approach an equilibrium point. Second one is all trajectories go to which means it is a runaway arms race. And the last one is all trajectories go to zero, which means it is a mutual disarmament. A simplified mathematical model for an arm race between country X and country Y is given by the initial value problem. In order to solve the problem, we use Laplace transform. First of all, we need to Laplace both sides of all the ordinary differential equations and we got the equation 7 and 9. Then, we need to substitute the value of initial condition into equation 7 and 9 and we get equation 11 and 12. Next, substitute equation 11 into 12 
and we get function x in term of s equal to 3 over 5 s plus 1 over s minus 1 plus 2 over 5 times s plus 5. Then, by using Laplace inverse, we get the solution for x in term of t, which is 3 over 5 plus exponent to the power of t plus 2 over 5 times exponent to the power of negative 5t. Then, to find yt, we use equation 3, where yt equal 2x prime t plus 3xt minus 1 over 4. Lastly, substitute the value of x prime t and xt, we get yt equal to exponential to the power of t minus 1 over 5 times exponential to the power of 5t plus 1 over 5. Based on the graph B4, we can see that as t approach infinity, x and y also approach to infinity. According to Richardson, there will be a runaway arms race between these two countries. A runaway arms race means that a change in one country indirectly causes a change in the other country. It also can be seen from the graph that the amount of weaponry in country x is always greater than country y. Now, we proceed to the conclusion. Overall, all the objectives are achieved. Ordinary differential equation can be used to model the arms race equation. Other than that, we can use Laplace transform to solve the IBP that involves Richardson's arms race model. Based on the model, the two countries had a runaway arms race. And the last one, we recognize the importance of mathematics in our life, especially in military. And the last one is recommendation! Yay! The classic Richardson's arms race model gave a good fit to expenditure of several European states in World War I period. However, in other cases where an arms race is expected, the reaction of one nation to its adversary is insignificant. Hence, models more complex than the classical model need to be considered if arms race models are expected to capture the behavior of a wide range of cases. <laughs>